Hey folks, I'm just in my car and waiting for somebody decided to shoot a quick video. I got a couple of questions to my channel about whether the new iPad with Retina display is better for reading purposes or the Amazon Kindle with the e-ink technology is better. And I think still the Amazon Kindle with e-ink is better for long haul reading because number one, the form factor is much lighter than the iPad. The iPad is still kind of heavy and um, bulky to read on for hours and hours on end. Um, also the e-ink screen on the touch, on the Amazon Kindle Touch is so much nicer. It's uh, The iPad is still a backlit screen and I have found that after an hour or two of reading on the iPad I do get some eye strain uh, from the backlight being on uh, and shining in my eyes where I don't have that problem with the e-ink screen. The e-ink technology is very book-like and uh, I find that it does not give me eye fatigue whatsoever. Um, so it's uh, a lot nicer to read on for long haul reading of novels and long books and stuff like that. Now that being said though, the new iPad third generation with the retina display is much improved over prior versions of the iPad so it's definitely going to be an improvement and if you only can have one device certainly make it the iPad because it can do so much more uh, than an Amazon Kindle Touch. Um, in addition to the reading of books and stuff like that it can also do you know obviously videos and uh, email and internet and and uh, Netflix and photos and you know all that stuff so it's more of a computer whereas the Kindle Touch is strictly an e-reader um, but that being said if you can afford both I would recommend you get a Kindle Touch in addition to an iPad because they do you know uh, serve uh, their own purposes and I find that you know it works really well in terms of grabbing it and going and having my books with me um, whereas I'm less likely to you know, grab uh, the iPad and just go and, uh, you know, the iPad doesn't really fit in my pocket as easily and stuff like that. So, you know, every, every, each device has trade-offs, but if you can afford both of them, I think that uh, you'd enjoy reading on both of them. And um, for long haul reading, if you like to read books and novels a lot and stuff, uh, I think the Kindle is going to be the way to go uh, for that. But, you know, so for spe for specifically reading purposes, I think the Kindle wins out with the e-ink screen. I just am real, really a big fan of the e-ink screen um, for reading of, you know, long-form reading. But for pretty much everything else, the iPad wins. So thanks for watching. If you have any questions or comments, I will uh, uh, like to read them, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.